right, fam. So I'm sitting here waiting on the full jerk. I'm sitting here waiting on the full. I done placed the order. But I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Y'all see who done pulled up, yeah. The Popo done pulled up. And you feel me? Honestly, I don't feel comfortable. So it's about time for me to get up out of here. JTF! Kisa! What's good? Another day. Another video. GTF was going on. GTF was going on. If you woke up this morning, you are blessed, Jerk. Y'all most definitely blessed if you woke up this morning, man. Y'all see where we at with it, man. We at that gas station that remind me of the ATM. I'm going to call this the ATM gas station. You understand me? But you're not able to pull money out yet, but you feel me? It does resemble an ATM at the gas pump. But what's good, though, fam? What's going on, man? Today, y'all see what we got going on, man. We got the rental, man. You feel me? Y'all already know what the rental mean, man. Last weekend, we ain't take no road trip. You understand me? Due to personal reasons. This weekend, I'm like, man, you know what? We got to take that road trip. You understand me? So, uh, I don't even know where we going yet, to be honest with you. I didn't know we taking a road trip and we going to find some food to eat. Uh, I don't really know how far I feel like driving today. Uh, one, two, three, maybe four hours. I'm not even sure. You understand me? Huh? Nah, bro. GB, GB, just chill, bro. Just chill, bro. Just chill. But yeah, man. Uh, yeah. One, two, three, four hours. I'm not even sure, fam. Um, I don't even know what I'm feeling like eating today. You feel me? I just mean, we're going to get on this road. We're going to find some food to eat, feel me? Give y'all some of that road trip footage, you understand me? Um, but yeah, man, we about to pump this fuel. Hey, ZB, you got some snaps on the petrol? Oh, oh. Fool, you ain't never got no bread towards the petrol, bro. Jeez, bro, this man be tripping, bro. But anyway, fam, let's pump this gas. Alright fam, we got the fuel here, and I ain't gonna lie, your boy ain't happy right now. Fam, it just cost me $61.17 Kisa to fill up this dog's charger. Dog, this is why I like renting compact cars. I let these people at Enterprise talk me into getting this car. It was, you feel me, it was around the same price as a compact car this weekend. But at the end of the day, boy, the amount I gotta spend on fuel is gonna be a ZB. I ain't gonna lie, bro. You gotta throw a boy, throw your boy something towards that fuel, bro. That's sixty something dollars, bro. Damn, that's crazy. I ain't gonna lie, man. After this time, man, we gonna go back to compact cars, bro. We ain't doing this, man. Sixty dollars on fuel—that's ridiculous to me, fam. You feel me? But well, anyway, fam, we about to jump on this road. Lego. Alright fam, we just made it here. We in Bell Glade, Florida with it, man. I ain't even gonna cap with y'all. Growing up, I always heard about Bell Glade, Bell Glade this and Bell Glade that, but I have never been in Bell been to Bell Glade before. It was about an hour and some change away from me. You understand me? My first time in Bell Glade. So basically, uh the restaurant we looked up is a restaurant called Famous Wings. You understand me down here in Bell Glade, Florida. In 1, and feet. that's where we headed to. Turn left you know, on so West see what Avenue Bell Glade, A. Uh, see what Famous Wings got got to offer here. Well, I ain't gonna lie though, man. It's different out here in Bell Glade, man. You feel me? It look like it's way less act well, it, I, I mean I ain't gonna say it look like it. It's definitely way less activity than Miami. You feel me? Looking real looking real different, you feel me? Alright fam, we pulling up right now. Alright 
Simmons right here to the right hand side. Are they open? I see no type of activity going on. All right, fam. Let's go see what that famous wings fool hitting for. Get your buzzer that's out the way, bro. All right, fam, we in here, man. I ain't even gonna lie to y'all, man. They got a big menu up there. They got a big menu up there, man. All this selection, y'all see what's going on? Crazy. All right, fam, so I'm sitting here waiting on the food. Yeah. I'm sitting here waiting on the food. I done placed the order. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Y'all see how done pulled up, man. The popo done pulled up. And you feel me? Honestly, I don't feel comfortable, so it's about time for me to get up out of here. Yeah. Alright fam, we got the grub, yard. I can't show it to y'all right now, man, because I got a lot of stuff in my hand. Alright fam, we got the grub. Fam, I ain't gonna lie, you can see from, from the inside of the restaurant to the outside of the car, to walking outside to getting in the car, to getting to the car. Fam, it's how they need mugs outside, you understand me? But yeah, fam, I ain't even gonna cap with y'all, man. I ain't even gonna cap with y'all. When I seen the um, when I seen the uh, the popo pulled up, I felt like it was time for me to head on out there. You feel me? Um, not that I was doing anything wrong or anything. You feel me? It's just that I don't know, man. With you know, with the recent thing, chain of events that done happened between civilians and the popo, it's like you feel me. Like no disrespect or nothing like that. It's just like. I just rather not be around it, you feel me? Cause I don't know. That's just me. No disrespect, you feel me? If you if you feel me, if you if you like the popo, you cool. I ain't talking down on you. I'm not judging you. Whatever the case may be, it's just me. When they pull up, I just don't be feeling safe sometimes, you understand me? And that's due to recent events or what have you. So yeah. My fool came out just in the nick of time because I was ready to get up out of there. You understand me? Alright, fam. Time to set up Grub Tip Mobile Studios! I already know how we do. Hey, fam, y'all pardon me if the AC is too loud. I know y'all might hear it blowing in the background, but it is extremely hot out here, man. It is currently, according to the car, according to the car, it is 88 degrees outside. You understand me? That is pretty hot. You feel me? Like I said, y'all might hear me complain about the heat, but I wouldn't have it any other way. Definitely prefer the heat than the rainy weather that we just had about three, four, four rainy days in a row. You feel me? Or definitely prefer it over, over it being cold. You feel me? At least you're able to come outside and outside is beautiful. You understand me? And I clean up the mass. Getting ready for the pull up, you heard? Big pull up for the GTF. No cap. You understand me? Big pull up. You know, fam, I ain't even gonna lie to y'all, man. It's different down here in Bell Glade. You understand me? But I mean, at least I can say I've been to Bell Glade before. I ain't gonna lie to y'all, fam. The smell, the smell of the food busting about the bag, you heard? The smell of the food busting about the bag. Um, well, I ain't tell y'all what I got yet. I got, um, so they had like so much, they had like a big selection on the menu. They had like a very big selection menu, and, um, and, um, I couldn't really decide. And like being that, you know, I always, Every time I eat, every time, you know what I'm saying? Well, not every time I eat, but a lot of the times I do wing videos, wing videos. And there's nothing do wrong, wrong wrong with doing wing videos because I like wings. But I know some of y'all out there probably get tired of me always doing wings, wings, wings. A lot of the times I go out of town, I always get wings. So they had like a big selection of wings because it's called Famous Wings. So that's what they're known for. That's what they told me at, at, at least at the cash register. So I was like... I seen they have Phillies and stuff like that. So I was telling the guy at the register, you know, he was real helpful or what have you. And he was telling me his go-to is like, you know, lemon pepper wings, this and that wings or whatever. I said, what about what's besides wings? What else on the menu would you rather pick besides wings? And he told me about they got a special with the chicken Philly. And he said, that's pretty good too. So I got the special with the chicken Philly. It came with four wings and some fr French fries. But I got the Parmesan fried, Parmesan fries. In total, I spun, they ain't give me a receipt. I gotta start getting receipts when I go to this to these places. Uh, in total, I spent like $22, I think, $22 and change, if I'm not mistaken. 
I mean, it's pretty much a decent amount of food. I mean, twenty-two dollars Parmesan fries. You feel me? Um, four four wings with some the house sauce that they got um, and the chicken feather. So that's what we got, fam. So let's get into this food. Got a cold one for the GTF. Let's pop this thing open. All right, fam, this that close-up action, man. Y'all see them garlic parmesan fries? Fam, I ain't gonna cap with y'all. I love me some garlic parmesan fries. But yeah, this is their Chicken Philly special. This is the Chicken Philly sandwich right here. As you see it wrapped up, you probably can't see it too good until I open it. This is the four wings. Chicken Philly special comes with four wings and fries. But I added garlic parmesan to them. Y'all see what's going on, fam? It's about to go down. All right, fam. I ain't even gonna cap with y'all, fam. I love garlic parmesan fries, fam. I've been trying to, while shooting this short form video, trying not to keep from eating all the all the garlic parmesan fries before I get to the long form video. It's been a challenge, you heard? But I still got some left, enough to show y'all, you feel me? But fam, I ain't even gonna lie. This is a great meal. Like I told y'all before, I got the chicken Philly combo, chicken Philly special. Comes with the chicken Philly. The chicken Philly right here is like two pieces. Uh, four chicken wings with, with the house sauce on it and the garlic parmesan fries. In total, I spent about $22, maybe a little under $22, but I just want to round it up to $22 because I don't have the actual receipt in front of me. You understand me? Overall, fam, I ain't gonna cap with y'all, you hear me? I ain't even gonna cap with y'all. Garlic parmesan fries, hit that bit. Mmm. 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 Garlic parmesan fries, bussy! Fam, these fries are cooked to perfection. They're the crinkle fries. I believe that's what they call these, right? Crinkle fries? With the garlic parmesan sauce over them? Fam, they know something when they come to garlic parmesan fries, boy. Famous Wings, that's the name of the place I got this food from. They know something, I ain't gonna cap with y'all. Mmm. Mmm. These fries, made to perfection, packed with flavor. And we'll cap with y'all. Chicken wings with the house sauce. Y'all see that? Ooh, hit that bit. Mmm. Mmm. If you're in the Belglade area, most definitely try this plate out, man. Try this place out. That was the garlic parmesan. That was the um, chicken wings with the house sauce. The chicken wings busted. That house sauce, it's kind of sweet. It got some sweetness to it. It's fine. I ain't gonna cap it, y'all. Now, here's the chicken Philly. I already took a bite. I took two bites. Here's the original one. Here's well, here's the other piece, so you can see the size. To be honest with you, the chicken Philly is not that big. Upon opening the chicken Philly, I was like, this is kind of small. You feel me? Hit that bit. Hmm. Upon opening the chicken Philly, I was like, man, this thing kind of small. But once I bit into it, the flavor is big, you heard? I ain't gonna cap it, y'all. Chicken Philly, bussy! No cap. Damn. Damn. Definitely messing with this plate right here, fam. For the 21 and change, $22, not a bad plate. The flavor is definitely dope.
like I said, I wanted to get the, I wanted to try the wings, but I wanted to get something different because, you know, I'm always trying wings. Mm-hmm. Chicken Philly packed with flavor. Bread nice and soft. Mm-hmm. Yes, yeah, sir. I'm definitely messing with this plate, fam. I definitely say try this out. Hit some more of these garlic parmesan fries. Mmm. Fam, these garlic parmesan fries are addictive. I ain't even gonna cap it y'all. But if you put these garlic parmesan fries on the Philly, I think that thing be extra fire. Yer. Yeah, food, this fam is good. But what I want to talk to y'all about today, um, I didn't get the chance to watch the current episode of uh, Power, Power Ghosts, because I, do I was trying to watch it last night, but I was tired. I dozed off, you understand? So I got to go back and try to watch it tonight. But I want to talk about y'all again, too. What I want to talk to y'all is about Snowfall. I spoke to y'all Snowfall last time, but I want to talk about Snowfall again because, you know, when you watch TV show, for some reason, I be getting notifications to my phone. And I got this notification to my phone um, today about uh, Snowfall. And they started talking about some, is Teddy dead? And then it said, unless the flesh on Teddy's mango chest hardened to Kevlar and he's mastered some CIA trick to play dead, he's gone. And two shots to the chest from point blank range, Sissy avenged her late husband's death kept her son from the money she warned him would come with a life on the run and effectively severed her connection to a son comfortable never seeing his mother again if it meant regaining his fortune the last we see of sissy is dropping onto her knees with her hands in the air ready for the police to whisk her away to what indeed will be a lengthy prison sentence fam i ain't gonna lie to y'all man i know it's a tv show but that's deep dog that's deep so basically they're saying the reason what i'm getting from it is the reason sissy shot uh, Teddy, before he could give the password for the money, it basically since he didn't want Franklin to have the money because, you know, prior to that situation, Franklin had told, you feel me, like, he don't care if he see his mama again, he just wanted $73 million, you feel me? So she like, damn, her son is really lost, I guess, out here, you understand me? Like, damn, this what it's come down to? So she like, you feel me? That's why, I guess that's why she killed uh, Teddy right before, or she shot Teddy, rather, right before, um, he can give the password to send Franklin to 37 million. Cause remember he was gonna get Franklin half of the 73 million, you feel me? So that's just crazy to me though. I ain't gonna lie to you though. I, I remember seeing that part and I was just like thinking to myself, Franklin kinda, you know, like he kinda messed up though for like, you know what I'm saying? Like he put money over everything. You feel, I like Franklin's character, but he put money over everything. Like money over the fact, like you telling me, how you gonna say you, basically say you don't care if you see your mama no more. Come on, bro, that's your mama. I understand you want that bread, but bro, I understand you want that bread, but bro, that's mama, bro. You don't do that to mama. You don't say that to mama, so now I can kind of understand why sissy did what she did too. You feel me? Like, I don't know. That's crazy to me, bro. Like, this man, like, was so. I understand 73 million is a lot of money now. You feel me? But it's just certain things you can't put over money. You know what I'm saying? Certain things you can't put over money. You, feel? you can't choose money over your own mama, bro. Especially when you and your mama have a good relationship. Your mama loves you. Now, if your mama was on the mamas that don't love you and treat you like crap or whatever you know it's a different story but your mama actually love you she's active in your life or what have you like how you gonna just try your mama like that you feel me it's crazy but yeah man but the way they're trying to say it is is teddy is dead it, it, according to this article but honestly we still don't know yet until we see the next episode or what comes after we don't know if teddy's dead yet so that's how these tv shows work sometimes these tv shows will make you think yo you think somebody dead but they're not really dead just like when 50 was in on um, power when we thought 50 was dead in power in the original power when they burnt 50 up in the in the warehouse. We thought he was dead, but it turns out 50 was alive. You feel me? So I don't know if Teddy dead yet. I still don't believe yet until the next episode or whatever, until what they show after, they, if they actually show a funeral or something to that to, to that nature. You feel me? I don't know yet. I, I, I really can't say he dead yet. I can't confirm yet. I got to see. I got to see the funeral, stuff like that. You understand me? But yeah, fam, it's crazy, fam. Franklin chose that money over his mama, you feel me? So I guess that's why Sissy did what she did right before he could even get the password because he was this close to getting him $37 million. 
and, and since he blasted, since he blasted uh, Teddy, uh, you understand know me? It's crazy. But y'all fam, you feel me? We still in Bell Glade right now. I gotta edit this video down and then hurry up and get on down the road and get back to the crib. You heard? Make sure you try this place out if you live in Bell Glade or if you live near the area. You understand me? Most definitely the food was fat. You understand me? GTF for life.